Hi class! Welcome back to our channel. For this video, I will show you how to graph a hyperbola with center at the origin. Okay, so we are asked to find the vertices, the length of the transverse axis, and the equations of the asymptotes. Then, sketch the graph. So, ang first move natin dito guys is we need to rewrite the equation to standard form. So, alam naman natin na yung right side dapat ng ating equation ng hyperbola is dapat equals to 1. Tama? So, divide lang natin both sides of the equations by 4. Then, simplify natin to guys. We have y square over 4. Then, makakancel to. This is minus x square equals positive 1. Okay, so ito na yung ating standard form ng hyperbola. So, as you can see guys, na yung negative natin is nakadikit doon sa ating x term, meaning, yung hyperbola natin is opens vertically. Na yung may naka-upward and downward. Okay? Then, it follows the formula y square over a square minus x square over b square equals 1. Okay? So, after natin ma-identify yung formula, guys, is solve na natin yung value ni a, b, and c. So, a square dito, guys, uh, corresponds dun sa ating 4. Okay? Then, solving for a, take the square root lang. So, that is a equals 2. Next is yung ating b square which is, so since walang denominator yung ating x square that is understood na 1. Okay? So, ang b square natin is equal to 1. So, square root both side. Ang b natin is equal to positive 1. Next is to solve for the value of c. We will use c square equals a square plus b square. So, ang a square natin is equal to 4 plus b square which is equal to 1. So, ang c square natin is 5. Then, square root lang natin both side of the equation. c is equal to square root of 5. Nakuha guys? Next is, identify na natin yung mga pinapahanap dun sa ating direction. We, we are asked to find the vertices. So, to get the vertices, guys, so since alam naman natin na yung hyperbola natin is opens vertically, so ang formula niyan is 0, comma, positive, negative, A. Okay? So, we have two vertices. Una, we have 0, 2. Then, the other one is 0, negative, 2. Okay? Next is yung ating... Length daw, guys, ng transverse axis. So, alam naman natin na yung endpoints ng ating transverse axis is same lang ng ating vertices. Okay? So, hindi na natin kailangang kunin yun. Ang pinapahanap na lang this time is yung ating uh, length, which is equivalent to 2A. So, solve natin yan. 2 times a, ang a natin is 2. So, ang length ng ating transverse axis is 4 units. Nakuha? Next is yung ating uh, equations ng asymptotes. Okay? So, kung ang ating hyperbola is opens vertically, ang equation ngayon ng ating asymptotes is y equals positive negative a over b x. Okay? So, ang a natin is equal to 2. Then, ang b natin is equal to 1. So, kahit hindi na natin ilagay yung 1 dun sa denominator. So, ang asymptotes natin is y equals positive negative 2x. So, since ang hyperbola, we have two asymptotes. So, yung isa, we have y equals 2x. Then, the other one is negative 2x. Okay? 
So, after natin uh, makuha yung mga pinapahanap na parts ng ating hyperbola is we are asked to graph. Okay, so to graph guys, uh, yung shortcut na method na yung ituturo ko. So, since ang center ng ating hyperbola is nasa gitna, ito yun. Okay, nasa origin. So, gamitin natin yung A equals to natin. So, ang ating hyperbola is open uh, vertically. So, ang A natin is makikita doon sa ating y-axis. No, okay, so count lang tayo ng 2 units upward So 1, 2, so nandito yung ating unang vertex Then count tayo ng 2 units pababa So nandito yung kay negative 2 So ito na ngayon yung ating transverse axis Okay, then to get the um, Yung ating conjugate axis Gagamitin naman natin yung B Which is equal to 1 Okay, so makikita yan dito sa ating x-axis. So, count lang kayo ng 1 unit to the right. Ito yan. Then, 1 unit to the left. Then, pag kinonect nyo yan, guys, ito na yung ating magiging um, conjugate axis. Okay, so next is, gawa na tayo ng ating imaginary line. Or yung ating imaginary rectangle. Di ba? Yung i-coconnect natin yung endpoints ng ating conjugate and transverse axis. Pag nakagawa na kayo ng ating rectangle, connect nyo yung uh, two corners, uh, diagonal. So, ito na yon yung ito na ngayon yung ating magiging asymptote. Tama? Connect nyo lang yan guys. So, we have two asymptotes. Yan. Then, using the asymptotes, dyan yung ngayon, uh, i-curve yung ating hyperbola from the vertex. So, ito yun. Kuha, guys. Yan. So, ito na ngayon yung sketch ng ating hyperbola with center at the origin. Nakuha ba guys? So, this is the end of our video. If you have questions or clarifications, kindly put them in the comment section below. So, thank you guys for watching. This is Prof. D. I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye!